Oh, uh, they all getting it. Alright, fucking the coach. Coach probably got it for him, though. Go with the coach. Yeah, to be part of the... be on a football team, you gotta get fucked in the ass. They got they gotta uh, induct you with a hazy ritual. You know what I'm saying? Oh, Plus they got food stocked up for months. They got they got 2,000 MREs up in the closet. That sound like the niggas in hood. Yeah, you got some. There's a lot of motherfucking drug dealers in hood. Oh yeah. That, that invest in that shit. Yeah, but all these bitches just not smart enough to do something like that. What's crazy? Man. Something's gonna happen that's gonna spark it. Yeah, they keep pushing it on the TV. They want they want this uh, race right to happen. Let me get that. Let me get the scripture. On that. It's all part of the plan. You know what I'm saying? I mean, Zimmerman was a fucking Jew anyway to begin with. So that's just suspicious from the start. But the prosecution was set up. They, they wanted, they wanted uh, the government, they wanted Zimmerman to get off. The government wanted that. Like Obama and Holder, they be crying. But actually, they wanted that to happen. You know what I'm saying? The government gets exactly what they wanted, okay? The, the court system allowed what they allowed to allow, okay? <laughs> yeah, I'm saying. They didn't want his ass to get convicted for a reason. They you want, see how the prosecution was on. It sounded like a motherfucker after this man. They ain't happy. <laughs> they ain't missing a copy. That's crazy, man. It's just so obvious it's all set up. <laughs> uh, let me start this Matthew 24. I'm starting at uh, I'm starting at three. Um, and as he sat upon the Mount of Olives, the disciples came unto him privately, saying, "Tell us, when shall these things be, and what shall be the sign of thy coming, and of the end of the world?" And Jesus answered and said unto them, Take ye that no man deceive you, for many shall come in my name, saying, I am Christ, and shall deceive many. And ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that ye be not troubled, for all these things must come to pass. Yeah, that's why everybody's checking the news every every five minutes. You're checking the news to see if that missile got launched yet. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Like Russia just amassed like 120,000 troops right now up on the Syrian border. Hundred, how many was it? 120,000, yeah. something like that. Be because Israel, because Israel just blew up the Russian missiles. The so Russia just shipped some missiles to Syria, and the Israelis they blew that so-called Israelis, the goddamn Edomites, the, the fake Jews in the state of Israel. They, they blew up Russia's missiles, and so the Russia they got a serious problem with that. That's their missile. You know what I'm saying? That's their, that's their property. That's their shit. Hey, you can't fuck with the Russian shit, okay? They gonna come to collect. <laughs> they just, they, the Russians are some real gangsters, man. They always had a bad history with them, uh, them rats. 
Yeah, they don't know we like them so-called Jews. No one. Yeah, Russia knows about the damage they did to Russia back in before World War II, leading up to World War II, the Bolshevik Revolution and all that. The so-called Jews, they killed like six people. Oh, it's about that. Yeah, because them, so, them fake Jews, them damn Edomites, them damn hook-nosed devils, they killed like 60 million Christians over there in Russia. <laughs> over there in uh, well, Central and Eastern Europe, leading up to World War II. Yeah. And nobody ever talks about that. All they talk about is some goddamn Holocaust. Well, but the end is not yet. For nation shall rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom. Yeah, we got that going right now. That's why North Korea just got caught smuggling some missiles. They got caught buying missiles from Cuba. Because Cuba was just trying to, they probably sneaking the missiles over to North Korea from somewhere else. Who knows what was going on, you know what I mean? But they just, the fact is they trying to get their missiles. Everybody's getting their weapons and their missiles. They getting their troops trained. They getting the boot strapped, they getting ready. Just watch when, he, when he's in these race rights, when they escalate, watch these police, they're gonna stop using rubber bullets. They're gonna start using real bullets. It's gonna get it's gonna get so out of hand, they're gonna have no choice. They're gonna use real bullets. It's gonna get ugly. Oh yeah, and they're gonna bring out the uh, new technology. Uh, sound waves. Yeah, the L-Rads. Yeah, that's it. That's they got it. the L-Rads that melt your brain. They got zombies. Like, like Russia said, like President Putin said, they got they got zombie guns. They, they got a, a protest gun, an anti-protest gun, or anti-riot gun. And they can shoot you with this with this shit. You know, melt your brain and turn you to a mindless zombie. So you have no, you just mindless, just fry your fucking brain. Well, that's why kid ourselves. You know they get you to use that shit, that especially is. over here in America, man. These are Debotic, demonic motherfuckers that walk the face of the earth. Plus they got predator drones. The United yeah. States military got 30,000 predator drones over the, flying over the sky. You don't stand a chance against a predator drone. A whole, we got a whole fleet of drones coming at your ass. Yeah. Shooting missiles at you. Okay, and there should be famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places. And these are the beginning of sorrows then shall they deliver you up to be afflicted and shall kill you. And ye shall be hated of all nations for my name's sake. Oh yeah, earthquake, the, the earthquake levels on earth are the all time high. You know what I mean? You hear about a new crazy earthquake every day. Every day, every day, all day, every day. Yeah, like wait till they always say California is due to get hit with that super big one. They about to get blasted. That's gonna be funny too when they get fucked up. This is crazy. Shall many be offended and shall betray one another and shall hate one another. Yeah, that's all you got. The hatred is building up in America. Everybody hates each other. You got white people hating black people, black people hating white people. You know what I'm saying? Don't uh nobody likes the Mexicans, okay? <laughs> they're, they're like they, they treat Mexicans like they're animals. The new nigga. Yeah. So they build up all kind of hatred against one another. When, it's always been there. Yeah, but it's, you know, but they getting back in that raw racist spirit. Getting back, you can sense it. Yeah, I can feel it. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, you see these dumbass niggas, first ones to be trying to pacify motherfuckers. Trying to, trying to, everybody need to calm down. Yeah, I hate motherfuckers like that, man. Go clap them pastors and shit. This is one motherfucker at the gym, man. All he's doing is going around talking to each and every motherfucking white person. He passed, man. He going out of this way. I know during this whole Trayvon Martin thing, I know this one thing. Is I heard African American more times than I ever heard in my life. Oh, no. It was pushing that hard. African American, African American, African American. I heard that shit five billion times. Ain't no such thing as no damn African American. You know, I've been watching it the time. I, I didn't watch this. I just watched the news. I watched the funny clips when that fat bitch would testify. Yeah, that shit was hilarious. Man. I, went, I watched his mom testify to laugh. That bitch was hard. Oh, my goodness. That, that, that's just, the whole thing was all set up. Pretend again. That's good, though. Because the Lord said yeah, he didn't come to bring peace. The Lord said that's he right. came to bring division. That's right. That's right. And we waiting for this. We praying for this shit to escalate. And, you know, 
bullets start flying. Oh, there's gonna be a lot of bullets flying before the missiles fly. Okay, I'm reaching again. Crazy. And then shall many be offended and shall betray one another and shall hate one another. And many false prophets shall rise and shall deceive many. Yeah, you got all kind of false prophets out Al here. Sharpton's out in the front of you. Al Sharpton. And they always, they call themselves African Americans. The Bible is the book of the Israelites. So how are you going to call yourself an African American, but you a Christian, but the Bible is, is all about Israel? Farrakhan, Farrakhan calls himself Muslim. But he don't read nothing but the Bible. Right. That's all he comes out of. Is the, the only scriptures he ever reads in the Bible. He don't never read no sentences out of the Quran. I've ever. never, ever seen that son of a bitch, old son of a bitch. It ain't, out of the it ain't got no power. The words don't hold no power. They, they don't hold no weight. You know what I'm saying? The Quran don't hold, ain't got no weight. He got no, there ain't nothing deep about it. There's nothing spiritual about it. There's nothing mysterious about it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Well, there's mysteries in the Bible. Ain't nothing mysterious about the Quran. Yeah, history still being yeah. real to prophets. Ain't no prophecies up in the Quran. So that's why everybody reads out the Bible, because the Bible is the only word that have any power. To Bright Square and Scarborough Boulevard. like the Incredible Hulk, take a bus, Ooh. make some gloves out of it. <laughs> that was some dope shit when they did that. It had to be the Israelites I did that. Well, Israelite created the Incredible Hulk. Your boy Jack Kirby. It had to be an Israelite. And because iniquity shall abound, the love of many shall wax cold. Yeah, so there ain't no love out here, man. Ain't no love in the city. You know what I'm saying? It's a fuck. It's not a fuck, though, man. But yeah, they claim, everybody claim like they all lovey dovey. Well, they loving the wrong shit. They loving faggots. You, you know what I'm saying? Everybody's pushing for gay rights. People saying gay people are the new black people. Like, they're on some kind of great quest for liberation or something. What the fuck is that, man? You're a faggot. Okay, a faggot is not. Being a faggot's an action. It's, it's, a, it's a wicked action. It's some wicked shit, man. Going up on the side of another man's asshole, oh, getting doo-doo all over the place. Mm -hmm. What the fuck is that, man? Mm -hmm. You fighting for the right for someone to go up in someone's shitty asshole. Mm -hmm. What kind of dumbass? That don't even make no fucking sense. Going out of another man's ass. Yeah, they do that, too. Be blowing it up. <laughs> That's why they always going to the hospital. Like, like, you know, like we, we always say, uh... All these faggots blowing each other's assholes out and giving each other the, the diseases, that's driving up insurance rates. Making insurance cost more money. That should be a sidewalk. Because half the people at the damn hospital are faggots up there because they got a blown out asshole. They just don't blew their ass out. What kind of sick shit is that? <laughs> let's, be, now let's be real. He's yeah. probably bumming money off of her. Oh, yeah, he probably is. He's probably confusing. Looking like Huckleberry Finn and shit. Looking like Lucy. Like cartoon <laughs> These people are like cartoon characters, man. Because these motherfuckers ain't living in reality. Oh, go ahead. And because iniquity shall abound, the love of many shall wax cold. But he that shall endure unto the end. The same shall be saved. Yeah, endure to the end. That's talking about teaching the truth, pushing the truth, spreading the truth. Because most people, ain't, first of all, most people ain't gonna do what we do in the first place. Soon they're gonna be having trucks like that full of dead bodies. It's probably yeah, what they're for. They are, yeah. Yeah, yeah. but. Yeah. Yeah, but nobody would even even take that first step to come out here and just teach the truth to somebody. Because if you know this truth, that's your job to teach it. You can be held accountable if you don't. You know what, bro? And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations, and then the and then shall the end come. When ye therefore shall see the abomination of desolation 
spoken of by Daniel the prophet, stand in the holy place, whoso readeth, let him understand. Then let them which be in Judea flee into the mountains. Let him which is on the house. Yeah, that's talking about Israel being scattered because after the Romans, they sacked Jerusalem, they destroyed uh, Jerusalem around 78, up in 70 AD. Then after that, uh, Israel, they had to flee, they had to get up out of there, that the Romans was gonna kill them. So that's, that's one of the many ways of how Israel got scattered among the other nations. You know what I'm saying? They could stay in Israel, they had to get the fuck up out of there. That's why I said that school there. Yep. Let him which is on the housetop not come down to take anything out of his house. Neither let him which is in the field return back to take his clothes. Like, yeah, you should go. And woe like, unto them that are with the child, and to them that give suck in those days. But pray ye that your flight be not in the winter, neither on the Sabbath day. Yeah. down the street loud as fuck. right now that this world is more fucked up than it's ever been before anyway look at all the weapons they got we in a nuclear age you know what i'm saying we ain't in the age of cannons we ain't in the age of flaming arrows S slinging air uh what you call what they slings have? yes you thought hit somebody with a sling we ain't in the age of hand-to-hand -hand combat no more okay we in a nuclear age we in a technological fucking age you know what i'm saying this technology, you see all all this news coming out about the government's uh, tapping everybody's phone, they read all your emails, they, they listen to all your telephone calls. Just came out in the news today that the government's tracking every movement of every car. License plates. Yeah, they got shit on the RFIDs on the license plates and RFIDs on the cars and on the tires and every damn way. So, that's what age we living in. shall be great tribulations such as was not since the beginning of the world to this time no nor ever shall be and except those days should be shortened there should no flesh be saved but for the elect's sake those days shall be shortened yeah so the lord he's making his thing speed up just for us and we're gonna be barely gonna be saved too it's just gonna be ugly it's just gonna get so ugly you're gonna think ain't nobody gonna get saved you know what I'm saying? Right. The Lord, he's, all he's only doing with the elect. Then if any man shall say unto you, Lo, here is Christ or there, believe it not. For there shall rise false Christ. Because like Heli Selassie. Mm -hmm. First one, because he actually tried to say that he was the Lord and the reincarnation was some shit, didn't he? What kind of crazy shit is that? If you, if you believe somebody like that, something's wrong with you. I'm a fair concert that same shit. Dude. 
He's a fair kind of guy. He said something similar. He was a, you know, he was Christ. And, you know, he was the last prophet to come. Farrakhan just, he, said, he actually said there ain't no other ones coming after him. Man, that's fucking fucked up. I got the tape and every fucking thing. Farrakhan just need to stick to playing the damn violin. Farrakhan need to go play with his ass or with his doctor's yeah. opinion. With his um, ass cancer. Yeah, look at Yeah, he's probably licking Al Sharpton's asshole. Look at Al Sharpton all shriveled up and shit. Hey, Farrakhan looking shriveled up too. They all look sick. It looks like they got AIDS. Like, for real. Yeah, they all look sick, yeah. Shit is yep. disturbing, man. But, I mean, it's very disturbing. Watching Al Sharpton on TV, that shit's disturbing, man. Look like his ass is real sick. He's gonna die soon from AIDS. That shit's like serious shit. Yeah, he's good for him. He used to be a fat bastard. You know what I'm saying? He used to be all fat and ripe. Now look at his bitch ass. All shriveled up and shit. Yeah, it's fucked up. For there shall arise false Christ and false prophets, and shall show great signs and wonders, insomuch that if it were possible, they shall deceive the very elect. Behold, I have told you before. Wherefore, if they shall Trump. say unto you, Behold, Trump. he is in the desert, go What's not forth. Trump? Behold, hey, he is in the secret chambers, believe it not. For as the lightning cometh out of the Trump. east and shineth Trump. even Trump. unto the west. Trump, Trump. So shall the coming of the Son of Man be. For wheresoever the carcass is, there shall the eagles be gathered together. Yeah, well, when the Lord comes back, he's coming out of the sky in all his power. He's coming out of the sky with the chariots. Yeah, it's going to be ugly, too. It ain't going to be fun. Yeah. Immediately after the tribulations of those days shall the sun be darkened, and the moon shall not give her light, and the stars shall fall from heaven and the powers of of the heavens shall be shaken. And then shall appear the sign of the Son of Man in heaven. And then shall all the tribes of the earth mourn. And they shall see the Son of Man coming in the clouds of heaven with power and great glory. Yeah, but most of y'all, y'all ain't looking for this. He called himself the Son of Man. But you know that's talking about the Lord. That's the Son of God. But most of y'all, you ain't looking for the Son of, son of the Most High to return. Y'all ain't looking for that. You know what I'm saying? Y'all y'all looking to do some getting involved in some retarded shit. You know what I'm saying? They go on uh, uh, have riots for fucking Trayvon Martin. They won't do shit for the Most High. You know what I'm saying? They, they, they don't get mad about uh, all these bitches having all these abortions. They don't get mad about that. You know what I'm saying? They don't get mad about the IRS taking all their fucking money. Shit, y'all should have been right. You gonna write about something? Write about the goddamn IRS taking all your motherfucking money. That's some fucked up shit, man. And then they're forcing your children to go to this government-ran uh, pedophilia center they call public schools. You know what I'm saying? They're teaching your children all kinds of bullshit. Y'all should be mad about that. Y'all should be mad when they shoot your ass up with some motherfucking, with some, uh, some vaccines that give your ass autism. Feel like you need a couple more vaccines. It ain't doing the job right. <laughs> Look, it's like Zimmerman's about to get stolen on over there. Oh, nah, he, he's been leaving this right now. They just going forces. They can look at Zimmer, Zimmerman together. <laughs> man, that's some ignorant shit, man. The Lord said my people is fools. So that's all fools. Right, because this all already been fucking dumb. The whole system was crippled with all the fucking hills. Yeah. And we've given them the motherfucking solution to fix it all right here. You know? These people are stupid as fuck. They just like the white man. They don't like instructions, man. They just like the goddamn devil, man. Yep. Let me let me get the oh, said, uh, how back of the fool. Let me let me get out. These people don't care about no truth and justice. You got all these protesters protesting all the time. But but most of the time half the protesters be goddamn faggots. You watch any protest on TV, and most of the time they got a goddamn woman leading it. If it's not a woman, even with the Trayvon shit, they usually have black bitches leading the protest. So they got a whole feminine vibration to it to begin with, you know what I mean? It's a wicked vibration. You know what I'm saying? Because Jezebel runs this shit, you know what I'm saying? She's, she's in control of this shit, man. These goddamn emotional ass hoes, man. They running shit. North High to downtown. Emotional ass bitches. Again, 
think that all the community organizers are all fucking women, for the most part. You know what I'm saying? Remember that Occupy Wall Street shit? Oh, goddamn women and lesbians at that. Some fucking Greenpeace, Green Earth motherfuckers. They need punch in their face, man. Hell no. Run around in his hot ass heat, fat as hell. Like Bitch might as well stick an IV in her arm before she start running. She probably shit her pants. <laughs> Uh, Habakkuk, one in um, uh, I'm gonna start. Uh, I'm gonna start at three. Why dost thou show me iniquity and cause me to be whole grievous? For spoiling and violence are before me, and there are that raised up strife and contention. That's what we got going on out here. <laughs> Some evil people out here. So you got numbers strike for con contention in America. Also mean it though. Yeah, America, yeah, that means bitter, yeah. Perfect one. Therefore, the law is slack. Yeah, the law is still only follow the law in America. What what's the law? Well, hold up. America, they got like ten, like ten damn billion laws. Well really they got like what, two million? Just, they got millions. That's all you gotta say. Is, once you get to the thousands, that's too much. You got damn millions of laws. But then, but it's at the same time, it's okay to be a faggot. Faggots can get married. What kind of goddamn sense does that make? You can kill babies. You can kill babies and shit, have abortions. But it's fucking two million laws. It doesn't make no damn sense. That's some easy, yeah, they got laws. And if, you, if you commit one crime, they'll charge your ass with ten damn offenses. They try your ass with 20 different things if you did one thing bad. If you got caught stealing stuff in America, you ain't just getting caught stealing. You got caught doing all kinds of shit, man. They had to charge you with 20 damn things for one act. Still a candy bar right there. Trump hey, you, yeah, Trump. that's terrorism. It's terrorism. That's assault. That's a premeditated murder. That's all kinds of shit. What's up? Therefore, the law is slack, and judgment doth never go forth. Oh, yeah, there's no judgment out here. For the wicked doth compass about the righteous, therefore wrong judgment proceedeth. Yeah, there's no right. The only proper judgment is the judgment of the Bible, following these laws and these commandments. That's right. Little goddamn courthouse downtown Columbus, man. What kind of fucked up shit is that? No, all they do in the courthouse is get your ass for all your money, take all your money. All they care, they just really interested in either getting your blood and sweat so they can throw you in prison. And most of these prisons are privately owned. So you up in prison making goods for some rich corporation. Either that, you going, going to court paying traffic fines and making the, the people who uh, control the city even more rich. They just getting paid off y'all dumb ass. And then they taking all your money out your paycheck. And every time you gotta buy something, you gotta pay a tax. You gotta pay a tax for everything. I think the sore man sooner we start to rise up talking about abolishing the IRS. Oh yeah. But coming up with a new system. Yeah, a new system. You know, yeah, I gotta replace. I can imagine how worse that would be. I got a replacement? How about slavery? I got a better replacement. Thermal nuclear missile. Oh, that's even better. That goes hand in hand with slavery. You know? Look at ass motherfuckers, man. Behold, ye among the heathen, and regard. And wonder marvelously, for I will work a work in your days which ye will not believe, though it be told you. That's talking about the Lord. That's talking about your house shot. And then they did believe it. It's like, hey, let's get that part in John. Because remember when the Lord came, they killed his ass. That's how much they loved him. They loved, they loved the Son of the God so much they killed him. What's that, John? Yeah, what's that in John where... Uh, they had Barabbas, and they were going to let him go and let the Lord go. Yeah, they wanted that nigga out. Yeah, and they let chose. Me find, give me a minute, man. Yeah, I can help you find it. Yeah, because you can read in the book of John in the New Testament, when the Lord's about to be crucified, Pontius Pilate, he told the people, he's like, look, since it's a holiday, since it's the Passover, I can let one of these guys go. I can I can, uh, I can, let uh, Yahweh Shai go, the one y'all call Jesus. He's the son of God. He's the, he's the way, the truth, 
in the life. He's like, I, I can let him go. Well, I can let Barabbas go. And Barabbas was a goddamn murderer. She, she, a damn thief. Right? Yeah. And they chose to let Barabbas' bitch ass go. They chose him over the moon. That's the same thing these people do out here, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's exactly the same thing. That's the same exact spirit. I thought it was a 19 show. I can help you find it. That's a bad script. That's an evil. Oh, it says, but for it, no, it's a way with the crucified. Um, you know how to spell the weapon? Uh, B R O D. I'm just looking for it. Oh, here it is. Yeah. Which chapter? It's John 18. It's 18. I was yeah. 19. 18 and uh, 37. Actually, you should start. Maybe you should just read that whole start piece right there. Start at, uh, yeah, start at 31. Start at 31. Okay. You can read all of that. There's some wicked motherfuckers out there. Some pieces of shit. Some real pieces of shit. Okay, this is John uh, 18 and 31. Then said Pilate unto them, Take ye him, and judge him according to your law. They talking about the Lord, okay? The Jews therefore said unto him, It is not lawful for us to put any man to death, that the saying of Jesus might be fulfilled, which he spake, signifying that death he should die. Then Pilate entered into the judgment hall again, and called Jesus, and said unto him, Art thou the king of the Jews? Jesus answered him, Sayest thou this thing of thyself? So even Pontius Pilate knew that he was the king of the Jews. They actually try to make him king. When you read in the gospel, it'll tell you they try to actually, a lot of the Israelites snatched him up. They're going to put a crown on his head. He got him out of there. He said this ain't his kingdom, you know what I'm saying? That this filthy ass world is not his kingdom. Why you want to sit in Satan's throne? Jesus answered him, saying, saying, Thou this thing of thyself, or did others tell thee of me? Pilate answered, Am I a Jew? Thy own nation and the chief priest have delivered thee unto me. What hast thou done? Jesus answered, my kingdom is not of this world. Oh, there it goes. The kingdom's not of this world. That's the way we are, too. It's like the scriptures say in uh, that 1 John 2 and 15. It says, love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. You know what I'm saying? So fuck the hell with this world. Fuck, fuck, yeah, fuck, fuck this, everything in this world. This shit is filth, man. And fuck these bitches that these niggas fall out for for this world. Yeah, fuck these bitches. Yeah, fuck all this shit. This is actually throw this away. After getting a good taste of this. Yeah, they double damn. You know what I'm saying? They, they get double fucked up. Jesus answered. My kingdom is not of this world. I can't hear you. I can't hear you. If my kingdom were of this world, then would my servants fight that I should not be delivered to the Jews, but now is my kingdom not from this. What's he saying? Oh, I can't hear that. I'm not trying to hear it. He's talking that Christian yeah. shit. Oh, I can't hear that. I didn't hear a single word he said. He's talking that Christian shit. Oh, thank love. You. He's talking love. Oh, good thing I didn't hear that shit. Like, it would make me mad. Pilate therefore said unto him, Most High blocked his audio waves. <laughs> I don't want to hear that shit. Right. Pilate therefore said unto him, Art thou a king then? Jesus answered, Thou sayest that I am a king. To this end was I born, and for this cause came I into the world. See, so yeah, he's damn right he's the king. He's the king of kings and lord of lords. You going? That I should bear witness unto the truth. Every one that is of the truth heareth my voice. So he said, yeah, if you are the truth, you're going to understand this. You're going to understand what we teach him. But if, you, if, you, if you're not of the truth, I mean, if you, if you don't understand this, you're straight up a wicked motherfucker. Yeah, I mean, there's a scripture on that. Yeah, that means you was no damn good. 
Something's really got to be wrong with your brain to have a problem with anything written in this book, man. Especially when you read, you're just reading the New Testament. If you if you deny the words of the Lord, something's seriously fucking wrong with you, man. Something's wrong with your whole spirit. You know, you're just all fucked up, man. You're just a damn heathen. Only a goddamn fool would have a problem with the Bible. A motherfucking fool, man. You got people always talking about all the Bible. The Bible, he, they try to say the Bible is a mechanism of control. You know what I'm saying? The Bible said the brainwashing. No, man, that's some false preachers that the Bible talk about. Dumb asshole. How about you read the Bible? It's people's whole, the only thing they know about the Bible is what they heard on TV, what they seen in a movie, you know what I mean? The only scripture people know is that scripture they said in Pulp Fiction. Read that scripture. They said the scripture wrong in the movie. They fucked it up. They always fuck the scriptures up in the movies. Oh no, we was watching this old western though. When uh, this bitch, we was watching it. Was that a John Wayne movie? Was that that one John Wayne? Was it? We, that movie you was watching? And that woman was getting out of line. He hit her with Timothy. <laughs> told her to shut the hell up. What he do with the bitch butcher? Oh no, he's on point. <laughs> they used to, yeah, they. Used to, you watch some old Western movies, they used to hit people with scriptures all the time. All the time, yeah. Like, damn. Yeah. You don't never see that in movies no more. <laughs> That's funny, though. John Wayne's with the Oh, yeah. But he ain't write that movie. <laughs> yeah, John Wayne's a big... He already is. Yeah, he's a big guy. That's what they say. A big time homo. John Wayne suck a lot of cock. That's how he made a lot of movies. You don't get to make a lot of movies unless you suck a lot of cock. That's how Hollywood works. That's how it's always worked. Oh, here it is. I'll go ahead. Uh, this is Matthews 13 and 19. When anyone heareth the word of the kingdom and understandeth it not, then cometh the wicked one. Where's that? Read that again. That? <laughs> this is Matthew 13 and 19. Yeah, that's a nice one. Yeah. When anyone heareth the word of the kingdom and understandeth it not, then cometh the wicked one and catcheth away that which was sown in his heart. This is he which receiveth seed by the wayside. Yeah, because that means you got demons on you, man. Mm. Yeah, because you ain't calling on the name of the Lord. And if you got a problem with this truth, especially after you hear us give you this truth. If the if only thing you knew before you heard us was some Sunday school Baptist bullshit, some, you know, some goddamn some Catholic madness and some idol worshiping, that's all you know. You ain't never actually heard the truth before. What we're teaching is the truth. These churches have no idea what the fuck they're talking about. In language that you fucking understand. Yeah, we speak the, in the land. We speak in the language of the common man. You know what I'm saying? But he that received the seed into stony yeah, places. Yeah, all them preachers talk like a bunch of faggots, man. They sound like oh, he's speaking perfect, eloquent English. That remind me of them. They just no different from a politician. And everybody knows you can't trust politicians. You got, you got the evil one on it. Okay. The wicked, what did I say? That's right. Who did it say? Oh. Uh, when, <laughs> when anyone heareth the word of the kingdom and understandeth it not, then cometh the wicked one and catcheth away that which was sown into his heart. This is he which receiveth seed by the wayside. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because he wasn't planting a good soil. You know what I'm saying? But you gotta plant your seeds in some good, rich soil where you can grow. Make you plant them in of dust. Yeah, you gotta make sure you water your plants. You got some good soil. 
But he that receiveth the seed into stony places. Yeah, I mean, if you plant your seed in stony places, I mean, going up to a church for knowledge. You know what I'm saying? You're going to turn on TV to learn about Jesus. You know what I'm saying? We're going to buy some deep, we're going to buy some DVDs on Revelation for the church. You know what I'm saying? Or I'm going to go buy me some Left Behind books. But for, I'm not going to read the Bible. I'm just going to get a book that Creflo Dollar wrote about the Bible. Right, right. You know right, what I'm saying? Right. <laughs> And, and I'm gonna go or, read some or the Daniel Seven's book. He wrote. Yeah, then they're gonna read some tarot books too. They're gonna mix the tarot in with Jesus, and they're gonna they're gonna get they're gonna do yoga too on the weekends. A little bit of the Quran mixed yeah. in there. This, these people are fucking gone. But man. not the Bible. They steer away from the Bible because they already know the Bible but never read it. Everybody else told them already about the whole book. So they know the whole Bible just by hearsay. These some dumb motherfuckers. The saint is he that...